In March 2013, the RCMP's National Division began its investigations into Senator Patrick Brazo and former Senator Mac Arb's housing and living expenses. Today, I would like to share the results of these investigations with Canadians. The National Division was created in 2013. Its mandate includes uh, carrying out uh, delicate uh, investigations on threats uh, to Canada's political, social and economic uh, integrity. We have a dedicated team working on these issues and it brings uh, uh, expertise to these issues in a number of areas. I'm very proud to be leading such a group of professionals. In March 2013, the National Division of the RCMP began its investigation on the travel and living expenses of Senator Patrick Brazo and former Senator Mac Harb. Today, I would like to present the results uh, of that investigation to Canadians. The RCMP has proceeded to charge Monsieur Brazo and Mr. Arb with one count each of breach of trust and fraud under sections 122 and 380 of the Criminal Code. Both Mr. Brazo and Mr. Arb will be appearing in court at a later date. Monsieur Brazo and Mr. Arb ont tous deux été accusés par la GRC. Brazo and uh, Mr. Uh, uh, Arb have been charged uh, with a uh, breach of trust and fraud under sections 122 and 380 of the Criminal Code. Mr. Brazo and Mr. Harb will appear in court at a later date. Canadians expect the RCMP to be exhaustive and unbiased in our investigations. From the information to obtain production orders made public by the courts, you can see the detailed work that has gone into these files. In filing these ITOs, the RSMP followed case law and determined that there were insufficient grounds to satisfy the conditions required to seal them. In some of these ITOs, the RSMP referenced that Mr. Arb had potentially committed mortgage fraud. Upon completion of our investigation, we concluded that the evidence gathered did not support these allegations. Les Canadiens s'attendent à ce que la GRC Canadians expect the RCMP to show rigor and a lack of bias in its investigations. The information to obtain production orders made public by the courts and uh, the uh, concern the work carried out in this case. When the ITOs were filed, the RCMRP followed the case law and determined that there were insufficient grounds to satisfy the requirement to seal. With respect to some of uh, these uh, charges, uh, it, there was question of mortgage fraud. We concluded that uh, the evidence did not support such allegations. These investigations were detailed and involved careful consideration and examination of evidence. Our investigators interviewed dozens of individuals and witnesses. As is typical with any investigation, we also reviewed and analyzed thousands of documents, including financial statements, bank records, and expense claims dating back to 2003. All cases are unique, and the time it takes to complete them is based on many factors. <coughs> National Division has undertaken these files with diligence and professionalism. I can assure you that we continue our work on other significant files. RCMP investigators continue to explore multiple leads, to ascertain all the facts, and collect the evidence in support of these facts. We will update Canadians when our work is completed. These investigations were carried out uh, with uh, rigor and the evidence was examined carefully. Our investigators interviewed uh, many, many different uh, witnesses. As is often the case uh, in our investigations, we also looked at thousands of documents and analyzed uh, particularly financial statements bank records and expense claims going back to 2013. 
Each case is unique, and the time needed to complete an investigation depends on a variety of factors. The National Division has handled these cases with diligence and professionalism. I can tell you that we will continue to work on other uh, important uh, cases. Our investigators are still exploring many different leads uh, to ascertain the facts and collect uh, the necessary evidence. We will provide an update to Canadians once we have completed our work. Thank you very much.